everyone, I am the Nerdy Plane. Welcome to today's tutorial. Today I am going to be showing you how to run the Elder Scrolls Arena in Windows for a program called DOSBox. Now, DOSBox is basically just an emulator that allows you to run old games that, you, that needed something called DOS and aren't compatible with Windows. So firstly, what you're going to want to do is obviously download DOSBox. So go to www.dosbox.com I'll also put a link into my into the description. Um, if you're not really comfortable with installing things, then uh, go onto my channel, go over to DOSBox and Windows for Beginners, and watch the first episode because that um, kind of explains the installation process. I'll go over that with you. Um, and but anyway, once you've installed it and got that running, you're going to want to go to Arena. So, Arena is a uh, game by Bethesda it's a first person game and recently because of uh, an anniversary they have actually released it for free off their website so here if you type in the Elder Scroll Scrolls Arena hit enter and as you can see there is www.elderscrolls.com so what you're going to want to do is I'm actually going to go to a different one https colon forward slash forward slash elder but that one works the same Pro probably it looks the same um so elder scrolls dot bethesda dot net forward slash arena now the reason why I'm doing this is because I think this is uh, the newer one that they've released because um, we've put it under .bethesda.net um, and also it's an HTTPS as you can see it's new so um, this is what it looks like you have uh, the legend begins and uh, all about what happens uh, you can watch a little trailer uh, a few screenshots and another little uh, write up of it so you're going to want to click on download the full game here uh, there are the minimum uh, requirements uh, don't worry about those DOSBox matches those if not it's better um, and then here is the terms of use um, I've already read them uh, but once you have read them and as long as you agree click on I accept and then the download will start so uh, I've already downloaded it so what you'll then want to do is open up your file explorer open up the downloads page and uh, as you can see there is now this uh, arena 106 setup so you open that and then you can see that there are these two files inside it there's arena 106 setup uh, pdf uh, which is just a load of the uh, agreement again and then there is this exe so what I'm going to do is I'm just going to close my file explorer, open up the exe, or no, uh, extract the exe. Um, I'm then going to open up my file explorer again, head over to this uh, C drive, and as you can see here, I've already created a folder, a folder called DOS programs. So if you haven't then do that yourself, create maybe a game called DOS, a uh, folder called DOS programs or uh, DOS games if you only really want to run games in it. Um, So now that you know that you, once you've created your DOS programs or whatever it is um, uh, folder, you can then install Arena to that folder. So that should have run, but it doesn't seem to be. Okay, I'll pause it here for a little while. Um, okay, we're open again. It was probably just a bit laggy because I was using a uh, screen capture as well. Um, but it's open now. So here you can see a destination folder. Now this is where it's going to um, install to. So, you're going to want to go 
Um, so as you can see, it's set to C colon backslash at the moment. That will actually install to C colon backslash, um, and then a folder called Arena. Um, so you're going to want to browse to uh, C colon backslash DOS programs, and then click on OK. So that will install it to C colon backslash DOS programs backslash Arena, and then click on Install. Uh, it's not too much of a, a long process, as you can see, it's almost done now. And it is done. So now, inside DOS programs, or whatever your folder was, you have Arena. Now this is what it looks like. There is one program in there that you want. Or one thing that you want to view in there that is docs and then passwords because right at the start of the game when you get to um the end dungeon then uh the, all of these um spells it asks you for a spell or when you get to the first dungeon end of the first dungeon uh, it says for example what is the cost of firestorm so you'll head over to firestorm as you can see it says 490 so you would then type in 490 uh, but you don't need to worry about that just yet once that's done you don't need that anymore you can go along and delete it you want to open up DOSBox and type in mount c a c colon backslash DOS and then whatever that folder was for example DOS games or DOS programs DOS stuff DOS programs and then hit enter. So drive C is mounted as local directory C colon backslash DOS programs. Now you're then going to want to go CD which stands for change directory and then a space and then arena because that's the folder that all of the arena files is in. Um, but before you do that you just need to enter your C drive by typing in C colon because we've just mounted our C drive so now we'll enter it now you can change directory to arena so now we're in the arena folder so here you can type in dir forward slash w to view all of the uh, files in it um, so basically just type in from arena from c colon backslash arena type in arena and then it will load so once that's loaded you can play it and everything um you will see that it will go very slowly so I'll just wait for it to load up um actually I won't I'll just show you how to fix that slow problem open up your start menu go to all apps And scroll down to DOSBox. Now, then go to DOSBox Options. Scroll down to um, CPU, and where it says CPU, uh, where it says Cycles, as you can see here, we're about just over the middle. Under Cycles, go max uh, then you're going to want to go scroll down a bit more to uh, a memory bit mem size now this is a uh, how much RAM kind of what it has the max you can put is 63 so uh, I recommend you put about 32 to 63 so I'm gonna put 63 as that's what I always run it under and then save it uh, now that that's done when you launch DOSBox you can see that here it says 100% cycles which means the CPU is running as fast as it can and uh, also it says memory size is above 31 megabytes not recommended so I uh, put 31 or 60 uh, free uh, whatever one you feel like um, 
so then you can just run arena again and then you will be having a non laggy arena so thank you for watching this uh tutorial i hope you have liked it um if you feel like watching any of my other tutorials for dosbox um go to my playlist like um you don't need to watch them in any uh, sort of order um just watch whatever one you want to feel like uh, i'll also run one I do a tutorial on how to uh, run the next old scrolls game which is called daggerfall um so you go and check that out if you want uh but for now thank you for watching this video uh see you in the next episode if you're gonna watch it